Are you looking for the trendiest gist in the world of sports? We bring you the freshest stories in sports. This is NX Daily Top 5 Sports. Follow us on our social media for the following stories and more. At number 5. Newcastle signed Brazilian striker from Hoffenheim. Newcastle United have signed striker Joe Linton from Hoffenheim for a club record of £40 million fee on a six-year deal. The 22-year-old Brazilian is Steve Bruce's first signing since he was named the club's new head coach on Wednesday, replacing Rafael Benitez. Joe Linton scored 11 goals in 35 games for Hoffenheim's last season, with seven of those coming in the Bundesliga. He started his career at Brazilian side sport Recife before moving to Germany in 2015. The deal smashes previous club record fee of £20 million paid for Paraguay playmaker Miguel Almiron from MLS side Atlanta United in January. Rolling down to number 4. Ewan wins stage 16 as Alaphilippe keeps lead over Thomas. Australian Caleb Ewan won a bunch of sprints to take stage 16 of the Tour de France, while Julian Alaphilippe retained the overall lead. The Lotto pseudo rider surged from deep to peep Elia Viviani on the line in Nimes and take his second stage win. Britain's Garen Thomas crashed when his gears jammed with 130 kilometers to go. The defending champion sustained grazes to his left hand side, but finished safely in the bunch to remain 95 seconds behind Frenchman Alaphilippe. At number 3, Callum Hudson Odoi agrees five year deal to stay at Chelsea. Callum Hudson Odoi has agreed a five year deal worth more than £1 million a week to stay at Chelsea. The England winger, 18, handed a transfer request in January after Chelsea rejected a £35 million bid from Bayern Munich, which he said to sign a new contract before the start of the season. The young star is understood to have been encouraged by positive words from new manager Frank Lampard, who said he wanted Hudson Odoi to stay. The the teenager who is recovering from an Achilles injury suffered in April is on track for a quick return to action, potentially as soon as September. Counting off to number 2, Otto Tay Mazov stripped of London 2012 gold for dropping a fence. Uzbek freestyle wrestler Otto Tay Mazov has become the 60th athlete and 7 gold medalist disqualified from London 2012 under a doping retest program. Tay Mazov had already lost his 2008 Olympic gold in 2016 after a positive test for an oral steroid in the International Olympic Committee's IOC analysis program. Now a politician in Russia, he's only remaining gold is from Athens 2004. The IOC retest samples using new techniques not available in 2012. There were nine positive tests before and during London 2012. However, the testing scheme has seen a further 60 caught cheating, including 24 medalists. Samples from 2012 can be retested for up to eight years after the games. Finally, at number 1, Maxim Dadashev dies after boxing injury sustained against Sabril Matas. Russian boxer Maxim Dadashev has died at the age of 28 following injury suffered in his IBF lightweight wel welterweight fight against Sabril Matias. Dadashev was reportedly unable to walk to the dressing room after his bout was stopped by trainer Buddy McGirt at the end of the 11th round on Friday. He was hospitalized with bleeding on the brain and underwent emergency surgery but failed to recover. The Russian Boxing Federation says it has opened an investigation. Secretary General Umar Kremlev suggested there was some kind of violation, adding in a statement, and I quote, We lost Maxim Dadashev. He was our young prospect. End of quote. And that's it for today on NX Daily Top 5 Sports. You can watch this and more on our social media platforms. On Facebook and Instagram is at Nigezi Extreme. Twitter to us at Nigezi TV. And you can visit our website at www.nigezi.tv. Four body shots. Sense that the corner of Matias knows where they're at. They were really trapped to a right hand on the inside from the Russian. There's nothing, no power, no speed coming from Dadashev at all. He just has set off balance with a short right uppercut. He's literally right now fighting. Yeah, the damage is done. Oh, good jab to the stomach. It sure was. Much, but it Undefeated Dadashev is in a tough spot. Gets set back. We'll listen in to what Buddy McGirt has to say to him here. Oh, 
Okay? I'm going to stop the fight. Max, I'm going to stop it. Max, you're going to hit too much. You're going to hit too much, Max. Please, Max, please, let me do this, okay? Okay? Look at me. 